This is the new record for the most views in a YouTube video that's not a music video. Today we're gonna react to it for the first time and watch Mr. Beast's one versus a million dollar house. This is a $100 million mega mansion, and it's possibly the most luxurious house ever Dang. built by mankind. And we're gonna be comparing living in this house to living in that the Justin Timberlake? $1 million art house that's built to withstand a literal tsunami. A $30 million- I mean, just pause and look at this $30 million house for a second here with me. They have putting green on the outside of their balcony. Why, 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 why is that necessary? I, I guess I would do it too, though. Palace with its very own water park. And everything in between, all Dang. the way down to this one dollar. Bro, I'm not even gonna lie, that was like the clean, cleanest transition. I, I don't even know how he did that. I feel like, bro, that was cool. That was Barely functioning cool. house. More of a shed. Well, okay. it's only a dollar. Why does this house cost a dollar? Yeah, we get another storm. It's probably gonna go into the water. Uh -huh. So it's worth a dollar for me to just to get rid of it. So you would say this is- Where is this? It's gotta be like Louisiana. It's a horrible investment for me. Yes, indeed. Let's do it. Let's He's happy. Oh, 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 this is sketchy. <laughs> what are the odds I fall through? Pretty high. <laughs> Bro, these are wobbly. I like how that chair is just- Is this, I mean, honestly, part of me feels like this could be like an Airbnb for like a cool remote experience and they could charge so much money. Holding on for real life. Does it have, have a electricity? Recliner, Look. A mattress and half a floor. I can literally fish from inside of the house. Yo, I caught one. Whoa. That's just a lure, I'm sorry. Oh, Got him. <laughs> now that you see us having fun, do you regret selling it? I do not. What if I gave you $2 to buy it back off me? No. Nope. All right, I He doesn't want it. I have an idea. Let's get out of this house. Later in this video, we have a house that costs 100 million times more than this. And because I never plan on setting foot in this worthless shack again, Bro just dropped nuclear bombs. Guys, that's literally real. He's not even animating that. Seriously. That's the kind of money he puts in. We're at the million dollar house. Which technically means you need to be a millionaire to buy this house. I mean, on the outside, this looks like that generic rich house you're gonna see in the middle of Ohio and you just look at it and you're like, oh, like they're doing pretty well. But like, I wouldn't think it's a million dollars. Show you how a millionaire lives. My first impression, is it's way bigger than my house. When you pay a million dollars, you get a pretty good- Bro, a TV screen on their refrigerator. That is how you know they're millionaires. That's probably why it's that expensive. Along with four bedrooms that look normal, but they keep going. What because Airbnb. this bedroom has a closet be a good here, one. which leads into a bathroom that is bigger than a $1 house. This bathtub is gigantic. I'm six foot five, and I could fit in this perfectly <laughs> comfortable. You have a movie theater. Dude, these oh. chairs are massage chairs. Wait, what? <laughs> these chairs each have two remotes. Two remotes. On top of the movie theater, there's also an arcade. Wow. I was not expecting all these features. I mean, everything about this is is ridiculous. Why do they have like a display of like soda right there? It was just strange. Pretty sick. Just for one million. Well, I hate the carpet. Yo, this house is awesome. That's an ugly I have carpet. so much more friends if I owned a place like this. And hey. ending with the pool, which comes complete with this unnecessary that is waterfall. Weird. Overall, I'd say this was a pretty fun house to live in. But of course, like if you're a kid and your parents have a house like this, I mean, I mean, just absolutely every Every single party is going to take place here, and I would definitely try to slide down oh, this. Here to I would try to slide down this all the time. And that's why up next we have the- See, he's zoomed out of here, which is like kind of where Mr. Beast lives, right? Mr. Beast lives, I think, in South Carolina or something, or North Carolina, I don't know. And he zoomed out of what looked like near it, which means this house could be the house of one of the people on his team. What do you guys think? I think it is. I think it is. I really do. What about his house? Probably not. Are you pushing? Okay, oh now we're changing God. things up. Jeez, man. I don't wow. belong. This looks like the house that you try to get to in GTA. That view is crazy. If I had to say like what my dream house was, it would literally be something just like this. The so pool 15 is million, much huh? smaller than the $1 million house, but you can literally oversee all of LA. Wow. Help! Hey! Hey! Stop, stop, <laughs> go inside. I need new friends. Let's check out the person who owns this house. What do you think he does for a living? Doctor. Mm, NFTs. He's a lawyer. It appears a note was left for us. Dear Mr. Beast, Thank you for visiting my home. You have given me the ultimate gift. I have a trump card with my kids forever. Oh, oh that makes sense because we just saw his kids are playing baseball, not t-ball, but they're big fans of Mr. Beast. That's how he got in. Aww. Also, please don't eat any of the sandwiches. They are very sacred to me and my family's been passing it down from generation to generation. Got it. The lower floor of this mansion comes with its very own movie theater and personal gym. This treadmill requires a passcode to use. Wow. 6969. Six, it's not 6969. Six, a guest bedroom entertainment. Dude, look at the privacy of the guest bedroom. Guys, before you eat anything. Yeah. Wait, was that an entire Oh, that's a whole bag. He left this out so he could sue us Dang. for eating his Well, too late now, Carl later. And an incredible underground view of the swimming pool. Yeah! Wow. 
master bedroom with another crazy view. Carl, come in. You missed. We got another one. Look, I'm just gonna be honest. I feel like if you own a $15 million house, these are probably like some like $10 billion Gucci pillows. I bet the owner is like cringing from this. Maybe, I don't know, maybe they're cheap, but. I bet these are like some expensive brand that. I don't know, that's crazy. To avoid being I wasn't done. Papers, okay. We decided to fly all the way across the country to Massachusetts for the thirty million dollar house. This does feel very much like a Massachusetts house, like just an old little red looking barn that they kept adding on to forever, and they have this monstrosity. This extraordinary sixteen bedroom estate has four different buildings. Why would you? Why would you want In that? In the main house, there are multiple living rooms. All right, hold on. But this one is the best of the living rooms and this property. It just gives, this is where Joe Biden lives energy. You know what I mean? Like this is like an old rich man who doesn't like modern stuff. This is grand. I what just, is I, this? this isn't my vibe. I would office. not want this. What book would you expect here besides I bet it smells like The Grandpa. Way to Wealth by Benjamin Franklin? Oh. Who made the light bulb and a book? Well, Edison made the light bulb, not Ben Franklin. What the hell did Ben Franklin do? <laughs> read this book? <laughs> <laughs> Past the living room and the office was the grand kitchen, where the what? owner had left a little gift. Aw oh, man, y'all got the most expensive house ever and you put your TV up so high it breaks your neck to watch. You don't need a TV in here. You don't need that. Top off the wow. house's main building, Chandler discovered that. She can hit golf balls off the roof. Oh wow, that actually is a golf. Oh, that was a joke. But that's when I not said even that. close to the coolest thing about this place. Because next door is a garage filled with exotic cars. Oh my god, we got Lamborghini Gallardos. This is like a garage out of a super video Legra, game. Super Legra, super I don't want to say it. Super Legra, super Legra. It's I think. like a candy store for wow. adults. And the best part is, this is just one of two car garages. <laughs> Follow me. There's more? Bro, there's more cars in here. What's interesting is all the cars are old, the house is old, everything's old. They don't have anyone I saw, any new one. cars. Holy. Well, okay, never mind. Oh, a nice first gen Audi R8 in a beautiful red. We've got a lot of Mercedes, which I don't really like. Some Aston Martins here. How do you even buy these cars? Whoa. Hey, I want three of the same one. Look at that. Wait, look. That's an R8. That's an R8. That's an R8. That's an R8. That might be an R8. They might have five of them. That is It's like a full-time job to buy this many cars. There's stairs in the corner. I Let's see where they go. That. Bro, this is like a closet with cars. What? Underneath the car garage is another army of cars. They should really invest in a light switch down here. They have 20 cars down here, but no lights. <gasps> Did Wait, I? No, no way. way. No. Oh! no way! No way. No! No That's way. why there wasn't a light switch. I was like, who could afford to? Look at how many are in here. We got Range Rovers that are expensive. Shut we got old cars, cars I don't understand. Some BMWs, a giant truck. Wrong. All Jeez. of the rooms in this house have been awesome so far. But if I owned it, I don't think I a would horse ever barn. leave this next building. This is awesome. That's right. For some just. Okay, okay. It is cool. But it just feels so dated to me. I can't get over how old everything feels in here. It's like they wanted to Godly feel 50 reason. years old. Whoever built this place thought it would be a good idea to install an entire indoor wow. tennis court. I just want to remind you that we were playing tennis inside a house. I mean, it's cool, but I bet it smells like mildew. I also have no idea how to play tennis. Gang squad, follow me. Wow. What? No way. Two story arcade. The arcade oh. in this house is actually 20 times bigger than the one in the $1 million house. Okay, that's scary, but. Whoa. But that's not all. Bro, this place literally has everything. We're playing ping pong mm. in a basketball court in a house. First try, baby. All the features of the $30 million house have been pretty cool, but this next room is what makes this place truly special. Head up these stairs for the best part of the estate. What you really want to see is right over here. Look at this. Whoa, they had Squid Games things on the wall. What you really want to see. The Squid Games little circles you got to cut right over Look here. at that. Look at this. This is an indoor water park. Whoa. It's like a whole other world in here. Look how far back the drone is, and it's still good. I mean, what? <laughs> this is crazy. Well, okay, all right. Dude, that's crazy. I mean, I've seen actual real water parks We're that were less cool water park. than I'll this. I'll see you at the next house. The only bad news is it's across the entire country. Oh God, if you live on the Eastern US, including Ohio where I live, you might be dead. You might be watching this somewhere else. And if you are, that's okay. Life's still good. It's a $45 million mega mansion. This Whoa. is a little oh, too big. Oh my gosh. That's This cool. is like the most open house I've ever been in. What? I don't know what majestic Whoa. thing this is. 
but it's beautiful. Dude, I've seen, I'm pretty sure I've seen this house many times recently. I think it's like for sale right now. Honestly, lost for words. This is quite possibly the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. So I called in multi-billionaire Mark Cuban to sell. How's it going? Hey, good to see this place. How's it going, little man? Mark Cuban? Mark's also the proud owner of the Dallas Mavericks basketball team. And because this house has its very own basketball court, you can imagine we got a little- Hey, if you got a kid who watches me and you want to meet me, and you got a million billion dollar house too. Let me know. I'll come. I'll come say hi, and we'll see your ten billion dollar home. That's cool. Ah, uh, Jimmy won't make it. Buckets. <laughs> right, just steal it from Carl. Hit that. No shot. I mean, come here. Look how beautiful the background yeah. is, by the way. Like, just look at the freaking trees in the background. It's like randomly in a forest down here. That is so pretty. Yeah. <laughs> Get to dominate, Jakers. Now we're gonna show Mark around the rest of the house. Now that we're all sweaty. To find out if he thought it was worth the steep $45 million price tag. In case you're wondering, we didn't go swimming. You know, it looks like I did go swimming. <laughs> How much do they wow. want for this house? 45. <laughs> Not worth it? Because it's Brentwood, that's probably oh. half of it. Is Brentwood with I bet, yeah, I bet Brentwood's what that it's is? made of for the flooring, no. maybe. <laughs> the neighborhood. <laughs> I also thought he was uh, talking about the wood in the house. Wood. That's funny. This Dude, imagine like just getting a painting of a girl putting honey down her face, licking her lips, like... Like, I don't know, that'd be a weird thing to have, I feel bathroom like. bathroom over here is nice. Do you have a couch in your bathroom? <laughs> yes. Oh, really? Yes. yes. Okay. We need to get on Mark's level. The number one rule is you have to have a heated seat. That's it? That feeling? Was I own one and I've had one for a year and I can't install it because I don't have electric outlets by my toilet. So what do I do with it? It was like a hundred bucks on Amazon. You sit down and you get- It is not cold. I agree. Wow. You don't need to make billions to be happy. You just need to be able to afford a bidet <laughs> and a heated toilet seat. Because that's where I spend most of my time. Well, even though <laughs> I'm sure Mark would love to spend more time wow. here on the toilets, our time here has officially ran out. So, Oh, dude, they're catering so much food and you didn't even show us the food. Look at this. Y'all had a full 10 course meal down here and we can't even join y'all on it. Okay. Up wow. next, we have a house whose price oh, they point freaking shot it with a laser a funny beam. number. And now we are at the $69 million mansion. $69 million? dollars for this this backyard looks absolutely atrocious the lawn's not green you think i'm paying 69 million dollars for for this no that looks no. like a villain owns it, it does it look does villainous. <laughs> how's this compared to your house Miranda Miranda. Cosgrove, okay. <laughs> it's a lot bigger than mine <laughs> that can't be true what's your address <laughs> the reason why this weird looking house can still go on that's a big dog by the way the market for $69 million is because it's filled to the brim with priceless art and sculptures sourced from all around the world. Oh, oh, you mean you put a giant red painting with a black dot in the middle and a freaking stretchy man right here made of glass. It's definitely worth $69 million now. Throw up how much these artworks are worth and we're gonna try to guess it. How much do you think this is worth? I'm gonna say 100,000. What do you think, Miranda? I'm gonna go with 80. Oh, she has one of these in her house. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> oh. <laughs> Only you know the actual price. Oh wait. I, I would definitely, this thing right here, the way it bends out, I know for a fact, I'm running down the stairs one morning, I run into it and it falls and cracks. Boom, 600 million. See, this one will be a fun one. I'm gonna what? go with a million dollars, cause it's like right down the opening stairs, so. Uh, 450,000. Very oh. precise. Very specific. <laughs> the $30 million house had a water park, 100 cars. This place just has artwork. Big red sculpture thing. This room over here. I, can, I mean, genuinely, someone explain that to me. I can't be the only one. I know I'm not the only one who thinks that's like crazy stupid, right? So if you think that's a cool piece of art, let me know. Why? Because most people would like to understand art more. Here, we promised them 30 times we wouldn't touch what's in it. Come over no here. touching <laughs> anything. Yes. What is it? This is a one-of-one, -one fully analog, custom home sound system. Made by the creator of the Walkman, which was one of the first devices that allowed you to listen to music while walking. Whoa. That's an impressive thing to have under your belt. I would not want to have to dedicate an entire room to something like this, and it looks like it would break. I gotta hear it, I wanna hear it. To made the Walkman. Can they just turn it on? I don't think this under your belt. <laughs> <laughs> Let's traverse across the skywalk. Oh my god, I'm excited. Oh. Another reason why this house is built so strange, for example, having to walk across sky bridges to to get anywhere that is it's because it's been meticulously built to be able oh. to withstand the force of a real tsunami i mean you gotta admit that's pretty cool i guess i guess as the global warming comes and gets a little bit worse maybe it's not a terrible investment i still hate it though wow. i wouldn't you see the here. tsunamis before they hit i your couldn't house I, you I just you know for me my 69 million dollars is going somewhere else what completes the view is uh, the neighbor's backyard. You can see all of it. Oh. Is the man who lives here is secretly in love with the person that lives next to him. That's his ex-girlfriend. <laughs> it's a Romeo and Juliet. And after checking out the last two rooms- I hate this house. I genuinely hate everything about it. It feels disgusting. Why would somebody spend that much money to make a hurt? It just die. You know what I mean? If there's a tsunami, just die. Just die. Inside, I had a surprise waiting for us outside. A giant red thing? Look over there. What? 
These nuts. Oh. Did you guys even notice the planes drawing that? No. <laughs> How on earth did they do that? I paid these planes and also bought a thousand billboards all across America to let everyone know that Feastables is the best tasting chocolate you can buy. Stop eating Hershey's and other boomer brands. Luckily, our candy is very affordable, but you want to know what's not very affordable? The Laser final beams. house. Or should I say, the $139 million, arguably most luxurious house on the planet, Mega Mansion. Yeah, I mean, for me, it's just not my taste. I wouldn't, I would not want that for sure. This massive 36,000 square foot mansion has things you'd never see in any other house. Christmas lights, and it's not Christmas. To a T Rex, okay. to an entire. Oh my goodness, Lamborghini Huracans. We got. That looks like a that looks like a a Cullinan. A More Huracan, another Huracan. This place Jeez. is going to blow your mind. And to make this house tour a little extra special, look at this. Look at this. Fireplace, 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 fireplace. Wow, at least four. We brought Justin Timberlake. How you guys doing? And Ow. this is Justin's house. He's gonna shelter. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh. If it was me and I was meeting celebrities like Justin Timberlake, I would like freak out. Like I wouldn't know how to react. I'd be like, I just would freak out, I guess. Yeah. Crap. Have you ever seen a view better than this in your life? This is gorgeous. Yeah, man, you guys really the CGI is perfect. It looks <laughs> real. <laughs> He's like, yeah, maybe it's top ten. I, I'd put a top five. It's hard to describe just how big this mansion really is. What is this thing? This giant square that blocks your view. That better be good. It has 12 bedrooms and 17 bathrooms split across three massive oh. stories. One, two, three, four fireplaces just downstairs. Okay, all right. Now oh, we're talking. with a perfect view of the Los Angeles skyline. I mean, technically the view doesn't seem perfect because there's a new house coming up, so your view is going to be blocked soon by that mansion. I always judge a house by the kitchen. Minimalist kitchen. You judge these things. How are you feeling? Um, well, let's keep going. At the end of the tour, We'll get his opinion on if he would pay $100 million. He wow. has it on standby if he likes it. Straight cash, homie. Everything in this house is built out of the most expensive materials on the planet. Yeah. For example, the walls in this room are constructed in- Why would you have like a bar full of empty bottles? Unless those are supposed to be actual fill bottles, not just placement. I don't understand it. Like there's just rich things that just we don't understand. Out of rare you know marble what I mean? Imported straight from Italy. You guys got to get an estimate or something of how much marbles actually Jeez, in this house. look how big I mean, that that's thing a, is. That's like- Custom done. Yeah, there's not a single thing of drywall in this entire house. Yeah. Drywall. It's a pretty sick chandelier. This chandelier is million over a dollars. million dollars. I knew it. I, you just, you, sometimes you just know. You look at it and you go, it's a million dollar chandelier, you know? The ceiling literally started dipping because it weighs so many thousands of pounds. It like, if you think about it, that's like more expensive than pretty much everybody, including myself's houses right now. Like, basically, this. It really keeps going. You didn't tell me it was a million. I was playing with it earlier. There's literally six million dollars of just chandeliers in this house. Am I the only one who looks at houses like this and wonders, how do you have a cat? Like, it, it's gonna fall off the edge, it's gonna destroy your chandeliers, it's gonna jump off here, jump off here. Like, you, how do you have a pet in a home like this? Rooms on the bottom do floor Do you just not have pets? There's a whole Wouldn't it hop the edge if it was a cat? There. If you come over here... Wouldn't it break everything? Wouldn't my cat try to this destroy that? Really what is this, an ice room? <laughs> Please don't. Yep. So, like, what are you doing here? They ran out of room ideas. Probably a 50% chance we're locked in here because that doesn't have a handle. Oh no, we're good. That would have been oh. funny if we were. Oh, his face. <laughs> <laughs> now that you know the house has a dinosaur, are you more apt to buy it? Yeah. <sighs> I'm still on the fence. Oh. <laughs> what? Is this a locker room? No one currently owns this house, so they put name tags of the few people on the planet that could actually afford it. I think Mr. Beast should be on this. Warren Buffett's worth like 80 billion. He's too Elson's old, he's gonna die soon. Worth like he's probably gonna billion. die soon. Bezos, like Jeff billion. Bezos been buying a lot of stuff. I can see him getting it. Chandler, why is your name not up here? Because oh. you don't pay me enough to be able to afford this would be my first response, but 100 million is a pretty big salary, so. All right, let's check out the whips. Woo! No, are you just posing? I'd just be sitting here. You really matched the house. Thank you. I was, I was going for that. Yeah. That's like the coolest thing ever. I love cars. Job well seeing, done. Wow. No one's gonna go in the editing room and clip that. <laughs> <laughs> this $2.5 million car elevator is one of the most insane features in the whole house. Basically, you see- Bro, they got a butler. Like which car you want to drive- Safety training mandatory. Do not operate this equipment. On the tablet, and it literally sends it up two floors right into the garage. I know what you're thinking. The main problem with this is it only stores six Lamborghinis. Yeah. And yeah. You needed like a, a 10 car storage. <laughs> right. This house also had by far the biggest home theater I've ever seen in my life. Whoa. Whoa. Wow. This almost looks like a real movie theater. This is the- <laughs> That looks better than a real movie theater, actually. Best movie it probably theater is. so far. And it's gotta be. And actually yeah, reclining chairs. It only costs 100 mil for that. <laughs> Check wow. it out, Jimmy. Wait, what's it? Press my massage button. Oh, I got you. 
Hey, I don't need this. <laughs> the most Bro, in where's my button? most my intense chair massage that. chair ever. Yeah, Chandler, test the massage. <laughs> oh, oh my god, it works. There's no way this is just the only one here. Man, this is crazy. Bro, what is wrong with them? All right, wow. lead the way upstairs. This is a primary bedroom over here. Hmm? Oh, and then over here is the bathrooms. In case you've ever wanted to shower with 10 people, <laughs> now you can. That's my thing, man. You can take a bath with no one, basically only yourself. But showering... I mean, how many people got a bedroom bigger than this bathroom? Just raise your hands right now. I know. Oh, look, it's a, the freaking flower from that one show, Beauty and the Beast, they just got. You can fit an army in there. If that's what you're into. He is. <laughs> and now the best part of the house over at the pool. The real reason this house costs so much. I'm pressing it. Uh... A smoke machine is this in the a pool? Screen? It is absurdly large. Is this the thing we saw earlier that I said, what is that thing? It's a little slow. And slow. It gives drama, though. It is, yeah, exactly. Yeah. It's a very it gives a dramatic effect. It looks like a million little I mean, TVs put together on the back. It's a little bit of a flex. What a gorgeous view of LA. <laughs> yeah, imagine if the screensaver was LA. I think it is. it is. There's downtown LA, and there's downtown LA. For reference, Carl's like six foot five. Yeah, something like that, give or take. <laughs> and look how tall the TV is compared to. So this is like 50 billion little TVs put together. So that's crazy. All right, Justin. Wow. You've seen the whole house. We need to know. Obviously, Would you, you have buy it? $100 million in cash sitting outside. Right. Are you gonna buy the house? Yes. No one's shirt comes with it. You don't like my shirt? Your shirt comes with it? Yes. I'm in. Does, does, does the bear that ripped up the shirt come with it? <laughs> <laughs> Is this shirt ripped? Because I can't tell if it's ripped. Is this shirt ripped? I, I don't even know if his shirt's ripped. Joint. I'll see you around. I don't get the joke, but I'll tell you right now, uh, guys, we can pull together 130 mine. Wait, what? By the house you just saw, check out 1200 bells. Guys, I think if we pull together all of our money, we all put in like a couple million bucks. We need to get a lot of views. We can buy this together. So leave a like. Let's get this a little more viral. We'll buy the house together. We'll all live in it. It's cool. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.